Good evening. Hello, people. How is everybody? Ready to learn English? Good evening, teacher. Hello, Mr. Alvarado. How are you? Ready? you? No. Very good. Uh, okay. Very good. No. Yes, I can see like that. Yeah. <laughs> okay. okay. Um, well, it's time to start the class. I'm going to start by taking the attendance. That is the first thing we always do. So don't forget to say present, to open your camera and to say, teacher, I am here or present, okay? So um, yeah. as you know, today is Thursday, Thursday, November, November 25th, okay? 25th, yes. yes, Thursday, 25th. November 25th, okay? So let me see, the first person is Alexander Emanuel Presa. Okay, good. What about Carlos Gonzalez? Presentation. Okay. Um, and Carlos Pinto? Mr. Pinto? Mrs. Rodriguez, Daniela de Rodriguez. Present teacher. Okay, yeah, I like to see that smile on your face. Elias <laughs> Ramirez Rivera. Elias, not here yet. Okay. Gerson Otonie. Oh, okay. Elias Ramirez says, aquí estoy. <laughs> okay, Elias. And what about Gerson? Gerson Otoniel Tobar. Gerson. Okay. Um, don't no, there's no problem. Um, Elias, okay. Hilmar? Present, present teacher. Okay. Hector Alfredo Marroquín? Present teacher. Good. Uh, what about Irving Osmin Rodriguez? Present teacher. Okay. Uh, Ismael Isaac Aguilar? Present teacher. Okay, good. Juan Francisco López Marroquín? Present teacher. Good, good for you. Karen Michelle, Ayala, Ayala. Present teacher. Thank you. Luis Alonso Carrillo Vázquez. Present teacher. Okay, Mr. Tejada. Good evening. Good evening. Uh, Metsi Damaris Molina. What about Rosie? Rosie and Abel Chavez. Present teacher. Okay. Hello, Rosie. Silvia Carrillo. Present teacher. How are you? So so. So so. so, so. <laughs> okay. So you're here. Veronica Susana Romero. Present teacher. Okay. Jessica Marisol Villalca Palacios. Jessica? Okay. <laughs> and then we have the Miguel Nantes. Presentation. Okay. Thank you, David. Este, teacher, solo comentarle que ahorita voy a dejar el vehículo a mi trabajo y ahí tengo que irme para la casa. Bueno. Okay. Estaré, teacher, yo comentaré que la niña la tengo un poco mal, entonces la cámara la voy a tener apagada. Solo para el presente la voy a tener prendida. Ok. Thanks for informing. Good. So, yes, today is our video conference number eight, eight. Nine, right? Our video conference number nine. Can you imagine tomorrow is the video conference number 10, which is hello, nine. teacher. Hello, Herson. Herson Tobar. Nine. 
<laughs> present teacher. Okay. So, so yeah, as I was telling you, evening. good evening. <laughs> um, <laughs> this evening's class is about practice. Daily routines or daily activities practice, okay? So tomorrow is our video conference number 10. It's half of the course. You need to complete the homework, the five homework, the assignments from the week, and also the midterm, okay? You have to take the midterm exam. Got it? Ready. Okay. <laughs> You're ready for that. <laughs> That's true. That's great. Okay, so let's begin. I'm gonna share with you the screen. So you can see the activities that we have today in our class, okay? And today I'm going to ask someone to read the class objective. So let me see, Herson, Herson Tova, would you like to read the objective for the class? Okay. Eh, es videoconferencia número nueve. Vocabulary practice, daily routine. Okay. Eh, class objectives. Uh, a day and of the class practice with participants. The, uh, okay, uh, with class participants with the be able be able to present in the um uh, no se pronuncia esa palabra. Okay. Using. Using. Daily. Daily. Uh, daily uh, routines. Routines. Okay. Yes. So at the end of the class, Sorry. participants will be able to express ideas using daily routines. Okay. But thank you for trying, Harrison. And now we okay. have the activities. Okay. <laughs> Don't worry, you are in the process of learning. Activities in the agenda, I would Me like... Pronuncia. Irving, can you please read the activities in the agenda? Uh, activity one, a review of previous class. Spin the wheel. Spin the wheel, okay. Activity Spin two. The wheel. Activity two, from up. Daily activities. Uh, activity three, reading practice. Writing, writing practice. Writing practice. Writing. Activity four, uh, speaking and vocabulary practice. Activity five, wrap up. Thank you. So we're gonna begin with the review. What's mean spin the wheel? Spin la vuelta a la rueda. Okay. Okay, spin the wheel. Wheel so, significa rueda. Yes. Okay. Uh, so um uh, it, you're gonna work in groups, okay? And in your groups, um one person is going to spin the wheel. And uh, you have to say or do what the, um, what you get, okay, from the wheel. Um, let's make one example together. I'm going to send you the link of the of of this website where you can spin the wheel. And um, so, give a second. Give me a second. So, let me see. Can you see? Yes, we can. Okay. So, um, you have to spin the, I'm gonna give you 
I'm gonna send you the link for this website. In your group, you spin the wheel. And for example, it says, tell me five verbs. Imagine in your group, Alfredo, okay. Tell me five verbs, Alfredo. And Alfredo has to say five verbs, okay? Then the other person, Alex, for example. You spin the wheel and, oh, it says, say an affirmative sentence. So Alex has to say an affirmative sentence. For example, I work every day. Take an example. Okay, and then we have Rosa in the same group. And, it, and she got asked a just no question with do. So Rosa has to make a question with do. For example, um, do you like swimming? Or do you like playing soccer? And, and then, I mean, she asks that question to someone, okay? So, is it clear what you're going to do? Está claro que es la, lo que se va a hacer. Who will spin the wheel? You. One person in the group. Una okay. persona en el grupo, ¿verdad? Vamos a ver si nos funciona así. Primero, déjenme enviarles el... A link, let me send you the, the link and you tell me if you get this wheel. Y me dicen si pueden ver esta, justamente esta. ¿Me dicen si lo pueden ver? Yes, teacher. Ok, entonces ahora I'm going to send you to the groups and you practice in groups, ok? You take ¿Lo pueden mandar al WhatsApp, teacher? Yes, yes, yes. Se me olvidó activar antes el WhatsApp web, but I'm going to do it right now, ok? So just give me one moment for that. And Christian, in this moment... Vámonos. Okay, David. I'm gonna make the groups, okay? And you practice. Teacher, a mí me parece otra ruedita. No, esa que usted nos mostró. Mm, le sale otra. Con, no, con otros nombres, con unos nombres me sale. Con nombres. Con nombres, ahí va a decir a mí. Nombres me sale. Ah, pues permítanme. Le sí, sale otra rueda. Con otros nombres. Déjenme ver qué puedo hacer. Ok, um, entonces creo que no se podrá hacer así como había pensado. Entonces lo vamos a hacer todos juntos acá en clase, ¿ok? Lo vamos a esperar a los que ya habían entrado a las salas. A que se regresen. Oh. 
what are you watching? Mm -hmm. I'm sorry. Okay, so um, is everybody here now? Guys, we are not able to do it in, in groups, in a small group, so we are gonna do it as a whole class. Okay, so I would like a volunteer. Vamos a ver quién quiere empezar. Un valiente. Or victim. It's easy. <laughs> okay, what about if we start with uh, Daniela? Okay, Daniela. Okay. Okay, Daniela, ask a yes no question we do. Ask a partner. Usted elige a quien, a un compañero, and you ask a yes no question we do, okay? Okay. Mm. Michelle. My partner is Michelle. Okay. Are you are you mother um police police woman, Michelle? Michelle. Michelle. Hello. Okay, Rosy, your question is correct, but in this, um, we have the instruction is this ask a yes no question with do using do. For example, do you have a pet? Tienes una mascota? Do you have a pet? Okay. Yes, I do. Entonces, Rosy, pregúntele a Michelle. Ask Michelle. Hello. <laughs> Rosy. Michelle, oh, perdón, el micrófono, si sí, no, no lo había quedado. Okay. Michelle, uh, do you uh, have a song? Do you have a son? Si tiene hijo, un hijo. No, I don't. Okay, thank you so much. <laughs> okay, Michelle, you are next. And you choose the next person. Okay, Michelle, tell me 10 classmates' names. Oh, oh, this one is easy. You have to tell us 10 classmates' names. Aha, uh -huh, but let's see if you. Um, Let's see if you can uh, remember your classmates' names. Mm -hmm. One. Los nombres de diez compañeros. Ten classmates' names. Okay. <laughs> Uh, Rosa, uh -huh. Daniela, Héctor, eh, Irving, Ismael, David, Luis Alonso, Mex, 
Lexi, Verónica, eh, Gerson. Okay, great, congratulations. Yes, wow, you have a good memory. Okay, Michelle, who is the next person? Michelle, who is the next person? Um, tengo que elegir a alguien. Yes. Al Gilmar. Gilmar, okay. Okay, Gilmar, tell me your five words. Okay. Um, forget. Forget. Mm -hmm. um, feel. Yes. Yes. Um, cut. Cut. Mm -hmm. C U T. Can? Can. Okay. And the last? From. Can you repeat, please? From. From. Or run, correr. Oh, run. Okay. Run. Run. Good job. Okay, good job. Mm -hmm. Hilma, okay. choose one classmate. Okay. Elija un compañero. Uh, uh, Elias. Elias parece que solo podía estar en el chat. Okay. Verónica. Okay, Verónica. Veronica, what are the days of the week? Repeat, teacher. What are the days of the week? Los días de la semana. Eh, eh, Monday. Yes. Tuesday. Yes. Wednesday. Correct. Thursday. Mm -hmm. Friday. Excellent. Saturday. Sunday. Wow. Very nice, Veronica. You did, you did a good job. Who is the next person? Veronica. Eh, Carlos Pinto. Carlos Pinto. Carlos, is Carlos here in the class? Carlos Pinto. Is Carlos in the class? I don't see Carlos. Sí, no, Irving. Okay, Irving. No quieren, se esconden. <laughs> bueno, yeah. entonces, Alfredo. Okay, Alfredo, tell me five verbs in the third person form. For example, if you say play, plays. Okay. Want, want. Play, play. Run, run. Watch, watch. Watch. Um, fly, fly. Excellent. Yes, that's correct. Thank you. Okay, Alfredo, who is the next person? Alfredo. Presa. Oh. Sorry? Presa. Alexander Presa. Oh, okay. Mr. Presa. Okay, Mr. Presa. Okay, Alex, tell me the months of the year. The meses del año, the months of the year. 
I don't remember enero. <laughs> January. Ah, uh, yeah. Sí. February, March, April, May, June, July, August, September, October, November, December. Great. Okay, Alex. Claps for Alex. He could say all of them correctly. Okay, Alex, choose the next victim. David Hernández. David, creo que no está, está como bien. Ah, ok. Entonces, Juan Francisco López. Juan Francisco. Okay, Juan Francisco, you have to say an affirmative sentence in the simple present. Where is Juan? No, no está. Okay, another person. Metsi. Metsi. No estoy. <laughs> okay, let's see, let's see. Oh, interesting. Metsi, can you please tell tell us about your daily routine? Okay. What I do. Permite. Ya me acordé que hice. Eso fue allí, eso fue lo anterior. Hace, no, lo que hacen normalmente. Sí, eso es lo que hago normalmente. <risa> okay. Es que lo anoté en algún lado y se me olvida. Bueno, primero. The first, I wake up in the morning. My routines. Day. Eso era verdad. Yes. Okay, you wake I, up at 10 a.m. I wake up and take a shower at 6 o'clock. I go to my work in the morning. I go to the kitchen to prepare a coffee for my boyfriend. I return home after work on the motorcycle. I receive my English class at night. Every Every day. No, every, every week. ¿Cómo es? La semana, teacher. Every week. Every week. Every, every week. Está bien. Justamente. Every week. Okay. Yes. Yes. Good job. Wow, Metsi. <laughs> Do you ride a motorcycle? Um, por ratitos. Okay. How, I mean... Siempre. Normalmente soy a, a soy pasajera. <laughs> yes, and it's good to be a passenger <laughs> because you can sleep, you don't get worried. I mean, in the traffic. No, no me puedo dormir, me caigo. <laughs> okay. No, in a car, yes, but in a in on a motorcycle, you can't, right? Yes, but now okay. you ride, you ride a motorcycle. That's great. Okay, let's see. Who is the next person? Okay, este, no sé si ya pasó Rosita. Yes. Okay, Jessica Marisol. No. Jessica. No, Jessica. Que no pidió permiso. Sí, sí pidió permiso. Ok, so another person. Aquí estoy. Okay. Ah, vaya. Ahí Aquí está. Dice. Jessica, can you tell us the possessive adjectives? Do you remember the possessive adjectives? My. 
I, you, he, she, we, they, it's. Okay, but okay, those are the subject pronouns. What about the possessive adjectives, for example? My, your, his, she, her, is, is, our, my best, <laughs> and there. <laughs> so, um, no, don't worry, we could hear your, your baby. Okay, <clears throat> Jessica, can you uh, select the next person? Uh, Herson. Okay, Herson. You are the chosen one, Herson. Tell us, say, ask a yes, no question with that. Ask me, or yeah, ask me the question. Eh, tengo que decir una oración eh, una pregunta, positiva y la negativa. No, una pregunta. No. Una pregunta oh, sí. de sí o no. Con da. Sí. Que la respuesta es yes o no. Ok. Eh, do you play in the beach? Do you like going to the beach? Do okay. you like going to the beach? Not, I, uh, not, I go to the beach. No, Do I not. don't. Uh, no, no, I don't. I don't. No, I don't. No, I don't. No, I don't. <laughs> yeah, but here you have to ask a question with das. The question starts with does. For example, Harrison, does your father uh, live in the United States? Not, uh, not, she, uh, not, do, uh, not, she's the nouns. Your father. Uh -huh. See? Okay, no, no, he doesn't. Okay, no, he doesn't. Yeah, because the answer is short. Okay, thank you so much, Harrison. Now you can choose the next person. No le comprendí muy bien. Okay, elija un compañero. Okay, sorry. Uh, Irving. Irving ya pasó. Creo que sí, ¿verdad, Irving? Eh, no, me. Ah, ok, Irving. Ok, you have to tell us about 10 jobs. Um... Repeat um, after me, please. Mm -hmm. uh, nurse, uh, doctor, um, account, accountant, um, a driver, um, engineer, um, police. Police officer? Um, architect. Okay. Oh, I lost the count. Uh -huh. um, teacher. Okay. Oh, that's a beautiful um, job. Uh, <laughs> um, chef. Yes. Um, no me acuerdo, teacher, cómo se dice granjero o jornalero, no me acuerdo. Farmer. Farmer. Um, 
Eh, eh, no me acuerdo qué más. Student, vet, eh, dentist, ah, dentist, receptionist, eh. secretary. Ok, thank you, Irving. Ok, y mm. la last person. ¿Quién que sea la última? Um, a ver. Ismael. Ok, Ismael, say a negative sentence. ¿Cuánto no, sería? Say a negative sentence. Una oración en negativa. With don't no or doesn't. I don't remember. For example... Um, la, la, el queso por lo de la... For example, Ismael oh, doesn't remember the sentence. Estoy diciendo una en negativo, Ismael. No recuerda la oración. Ahora haga uno usted. Ok. Um, eh, I don't remember my, my homework every day. Ok. <laughs> A good answer. Okay, thank you so much for all your participation. Okay. Bueno, la idea era que lo hubieran hecho en grupos y hubieran participado más, ¿verdad? Y se hubieran divertido ustedes dándole vuelta a la ruedita, pero pues no se pudo. Okay. Now, in the next activity, vamos a enseñarle aquí la pantallita. Bye. Ahora vamos a escribir los días de la semana en orden. ¿Cuál es el primero? The first one. Monday. Ok. Monday. And then we have. Tuesday. 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 Ok. Then we have. Wednesday. 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 Then we have Thursday. 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 Thursday, like today. Thursday. Thursday. Okay. Then we have a Friday. 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 Okay. Friday. 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 Number six. Saturday. 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 Sunday. Sunday. It's Sunday. Sunday. And finally, Sunday. Okay. Yes. Excellent. Okay, repeat after me. Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday. Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday. Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday. Excellent, Veronica. Friday, Saturday, and Sunday. Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Friday, Saturday, Sunday. Yes, and you're singing. <laughs> like you keep. Okay, good. Good, I like that. Okay, now just no questions in simple present. Yesterday we were learning that we you with the third person singular, he, she, and it. We use the auxiliary. The auxiliary yes. does. For example, does she ask for assistance? Yes, she does. No, she doesn't. Does he ride the truck on weekends? Yes, he does. Affirmative or negative? No, he doesn't. Does Elena make phone calls? Yes, she does. No, she doesn't. Does our company check the policies? Yes, it does. No, it doesn't. Okay. Now, in the warm up, there is another um, exercise. 
This is called work. Uh, it's it's um, an activity in which you read the sentence and you have to match it with the picture according to the activities of daily routines. Okay. Entonces se las voy a enviar para que lo puedan hacer ustedes. Hoy sí, espero que sí. Okay. First, WhatsApp. Okay, it's there. Ya lo tienes. Ya lo tienes. Daily, daily routine. Daily routine, yes. We have daily routine, okay? This arrastra is suelta los afileres. For example, what is the first? What is the first? Wake up. He, he, he wakes up. At 7 a.m. Entonces aquí tomo la puntita y ahí, ahí, mira, lo suelto. He wakes up at 7 a.m. Second. He was a shower. He has. He, he has, has a shower. Yes. Number three. He has breakfast. He has breakfast. He has breakfast at 8 a.m. Excellent. Okay, next. He wore in style. He goes to Aurea. He works and talks on the phone. Okay, what is next? Okay. Here, Aurrera is a supermarket. <laughs> What is this? He goes. He works and talks on the phone. Y esa es, es esta, ¿verdad? He works and talks on the phone. Y la que está la parcería es esta. He goes to Aurrera, the supermarket. Okay, then we have. What is the next? He works his dog in the afternoon. Excellent. Okay, then we have he has dinner we He has dinner with his girlfriend at 19. Really late. Okay, then. He watches. He watches Netflix on his smart TV. Yeah, boy. Okay. And the last one. He reads a hit a story before sleeping. Yay. Okay, good, 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 good. Did you finish, guys? Yours? 
Yeah, they are all correct. Excellent. Good, 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 good. Okay, so now guys, let's continue with the next part of the class. Did you finish the exercise? I hope so. Okay, so here you can see the activities or the daily routine of someone and they are in order. Están ordenadas, okay? For example, first I wake up, then I get up, I take a shower, I get dressed, I comb my hair, I have breakfast, I go to work, I start work, I answer emails, I have lunch, I finish work finally. I arrive home, I feed the dog, I cook dinner, I have dinner, I watch TV, I go to bed, I go to bed and I fall asleep, okay? So these are different activities that you can do. Can you please repeat after me? Okay. I wake up. I wake, I wake up, up. I get up. I get up. I, get up. I, get up. I take a shower. I take a shower. I, take a shower. I get dressed. I get I dressed. 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 I comb my hair. I call my, my hair. hair. I have breakfast. I have breakfast. I, I go to work. I, I go, go to work. work. I start work. I start work. I, start work. I, start work. I, answer, emails. I answer emails. I answer emails. I have lunch. I finish lunch. Work. I finish work. I arrive home. I I arrive home. Very good. I feed the dog. I feed the dog. Or the cat or whatever you have. And then I cook dinner. You cook dinner. I cook dinner. I have dinner. I have dinner. I don't see the other one. I watch TV. I watch TV. I go to bed. I go to bed. And I fall asleep. I fall asleep. Me voy a dormir o me voy a la cama y I fall asleep, me duermo. Finalmente caigo. Like a teacher this evening. <laughs> okay, yeah. so we have here. I've been, I've been in the club. <laughs> okay, so here now we have an example of a daily routine. It's about Mr. Miller. Uh, let me read the, his daily routine. Okay, Mr. Miller's daily routine. I'm an English teacher and I have a big family. So I have a very busy daily routine. First, I get up every day at six o'clock, get washed and dressed, and leave for work by 7.30. I get to school at eight o'clock. I prepare my lessons and then teach until noon. The other teachers and I always eat lunch and talk together in the teacher's room. I teach again in the afternoon, and then I correct my students' homework and tests. After I get back home, I help my kids with their homework. I have three kids in elementary school. Their names are exercise. Uh, their names are Matthew, sorry, Matthew, John, and Susie. Then I do some exercise, eat dinner with my family, and watch TV before I go to bed at about 10 o'clock. We love to watch travel shows. Finally, I read in bed for a few minutes before I fall asleep. So he is describing his daily routine um, from the morning, the time he wakes up until he goes to bed, okay? So right now, 
first, you are going to write about your daily routine. You're going to write a paragraph about your daily routine. Así, así como, así como lo ha descrito él. Y luego vamos a intercambiar esas, esas eh, de, daily routines with other classmates, ¿ok? Con otros compañeros. Así es que ahorita les voy a... Eh, les voy a envi enviar a, a los grupitos. Bueno, más bien ahorita todo el mundo va a escribir su... Your, you have to write your daily routine. Ok, so right now let's do that. And that is the first thing you have to do. Les voy a compartir la pantalla para que ahí puedan verla y puedan escribir. Sobre ustedes, ¿verdad? Por ejemplo, si usted es un mechanic, it was, I am a mechanic, and I am married, I am single, I have a big family. Or any... I am tired. Yes, I am. <laughs> so, mm -hmm. yes, guys. Vamos a escribir aquí. Primero un, un poquito vamos a, a organizar nuestras ideas porque luego lo vamos a compartir y vamos a hacer una actividad. Así es que, ahí now, let's work on this. No tiene que ser tan, 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 tan larga, pero sí lo más que puedan, ¿verdad? I will go to get some water, ¿ok?
¿Cómo van? Are you about to finish? Yes, teacher, we are about to finish. I don't finish. <laughs> You're not finished yet. Okay, um, I'm going to send you in the groups. Anyways, les voy a, les voy a mandar a las alitas. Um, y pues ahí van terminando, ¿verdad? En lo que hago eso de enviarlos a las alitas, pero les quería explicar algo. Bye. Usted termina su, su párrafo. You take a picture, le tomo una foto y se lo envía a los compañeros, a uno de los compañeros del grupo en el que va a estar. Pues imagínense en el grupo es en pareja, pero está Daniela y Gilmar, por ejemplo. Entonces Daniela le va a enviar su foto a Gilmar y Gilmar a Daniela. ¿Y qué va a hacer Daniela? Daniela va a escribir otro párrafo. En el que sobre Gilmar. Gilmar lo escribió en primera persona, pero Daniela va a escribir sobre Gilmar en tercera persona. Ay, creo que no puse aquí el ejemplo. Pero vaya, por ejemplo, aquí sería así, mire. En este ejemplo del English teacher sería Mr. Miller is an English teacher. And he has a big family. So he has a very busy daily routine. First, he gets up every day at six o'clock, gets washed and dressed, and leaves for work by 7.30. He gets to school at eight o'clock. He prepares his lessons and then teaches until noon. The other teachers and he always eat lunch and talk together in the teacher's room. He teaches again in the afternoon and then he corrects his students' homework and tests. After he gets back home, he helps his kids with their homework. He has three kids in elementary school. Their names are Matthew, John, and Susie. Then he does some exercise, eats dinner with his family, and watches TV before he goes to bed at about 10 o'clock. Uh, they love to watch travel shows. Finally, he reads in bed for a few minutes before he falls asleep. Entonces, ¿qué va a hacer usted? Lo va a cambiar a tercera persona. En el caso de Daniela, usaría el he y el his. Y Hilmar va a escribir, por ejemplo, sobre Daniela en tercera persona y va a usar she and her donde corresponda. No sé si se comprende, ¿alguien podría explicarme en sus propias palabras qué es lo que vamos a hacer? A ver. Si me di a entender. Lo que yo le entendí, Fisher, fue que lo que el otro compañero ha hecho lo vamos a transcribir pero usándolo de tercera persona. Cabal, muy bien, excelente, así es. Entonces, los voy a enviar a las salitas ahí para que en parejas trabajen, se, se, se mandan la fotografía de lo que usted ha hecho y entonces usted va a escribir sobre su compañero o compañera usando la forma correcta de la tercera persona. ¿Sí? ¿Sí? ¿Carlos Pinto? Yes, teacher. Ok, ¿ready? Ok, entonces ahorita los mando a las salitas. Elías, usted puede trabajar, puede tra hacer esa actividad en pareja. A ver qué nos dice Elías. Para así ver cómo los pongo. Ok. See you later, guys. Voy a estar ahí. I will be monitoring. Okay, monitoring the group. Okay,